Yo, what up? It's your boy Red, and I'm gonna review Rise of Empires Ottoman. Now, I like documentaries, I love watching action movies, I like watching dramas. This is basically everything in one. I've seen this done before. PBS does this sometimes, so does uh, the, the, um, the BBC, and uh, what's the other one? I forget the name of the other one. They do this. They have actors portray the people they're talking about in the documentaries and stuff, but they kind of don't really do much with that. Um, and Netflix has been trying this new technique of implementing basically the reverse of that. We have more of these actors, more of what's going on in the world, but we still get, you know, specialists, historians, doctors, all this talking about the characters while we're watching them in the show, which is actually really cool. It doesn't feel too invasive because they're explaining stuff in between that you will never really understand in the docudrama without having their knowledge of basically the subject we're watching, which is the Ottoman Empire, um, the Byzantine Empire, Rome, uh, Constantinople, whatever they're called. And the tactics and the different units that you see in the show. They talk about the Genissaries, um, the Italian mercenaries. It, they do a really good job in the show. And the actors themselves do a good job. So it's fucking entertaining all the way through. They mostly, of course, focus on the Ottoman side. If you guys didn't know, spoiler alert. The Ottomans conquer Constantinople and becomes Istanbul. If you didn't know that, I mean, this is history. It's interesting. But it's still cool to watch the whole process seeing their siege seeing each side and getting a sentiment for it right it was cool i liked it and enjoyed watching this very much so that i can't wait for a season two and it is confirmed i believe that there is going to be a season two so sometime next year this came out in january it's probably going to come out in january as well next year so be expecting that great show love watching it um, the actors are great like I said they, they did a good cast here I fucking enjoyed watching every single second of this show and yeah man um, you get everything from Constantine the 11th to Muhammad the second the conqueror his mother his stepmom his vizier um, the Italian mercenary who leads the defense against the walls you get a lot of characters here and they're all interesting. None of them are like ah, with pointless or whatever. I guess the only pointless one would have to be the uh, Constantine's daughter and her relationship with the Italian mercenary. I didn't really care for that. It was just in there. I, I guess that's the only one I'll be like, I don't even give a fuck about that fucking shit. Go back to, you know, Mohammed and fucking the Italian mercenary balloting it out on the walls. Giovanni, man. That shit was epic seeing all those fights. My favorite, of course, was Mohammed II. Uh, Kamli G. Uzumonglu, uh, hopefully I said it right, is the actor who played him. He is Turkish. He comes from there. He's a great actor. He's a couple years younger than me, actually. Wow. Right? It's great to see someone young doing something uh, now that I'm old, I guess. <laughs> but he's a great actor. I can't wait to see more stuff he does. Tashi Season 2. Um, everyone was great in this show, man. I, I can't really admit to how I enjoyed this show. I enjoyed... I love documentaries. I love battles like i said this has everything that i wanted in wrapped in one i'm gonna continue watching these documentaries by netflix i think the next one i watch is something to do with caesar or something uh it was a german one but it's still i'm gonna watch it um great 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 show i enjoyed shit um i enjoyed shit <laughs> i enjoyed watching this shit my bad and yeah i mean if you guys enjoy it hit hit, hit the comments below right what would i give this one i loved it I would give this one a 9 out of 10. It's not a 10 out of 10 for me because it's only 6 episodes. If it was bored, at least 10, 10 out of 10 straight up. Uh, but they couldn't stretch out anymore. I think they did enough job here. But thanks for watching. Hit that like, hit that sub. Catch you guys next time.